handsome and charismatic, energetic and enterprising, Sheets was a creative whirlwind. Through his artistic skills, his entrepreneurial spirit, and his leadership roles in academia, business, and public life, Sheets became a powerful advocate for the arts in Southern California, a man who viewed every aspect of the material world in terms of design. His feeling for form, color, and movement, together with his skill as a visual communicator, brought him a great many design projects over his long career. Especially his work for Home Savings and Loan Association propelled him into the realm of architectural design. One of Millard Sheets' deepest and most abiding beliefs was that the artist has a responsibility to serve society and to elevate the quality of human life through art. Well, let me explain very briefly how I feel about every art. Music, literature, architecture, painting, sculpture, dance. I do not think of art as being something that is so special in itself and only for those who can afford it. Every art is a, is a language, a separate language, through which you can express ideas and feelings that are otherwise inexpressible, uncommunicable. Uh, the art has grown throughout history for thousands of years as something that the human spirit had to develop and though it constantly changes it's, a, it's an evolutionary thing as far as style is concerned it's because there's no way you can express in any way to other people what music does for you music can change your whole spirit just instantly and it's it's something that uh, all human beings respond to you can't replace that with architecture or you can't replace it with literature can't replace it with anything because it's a special language that, that means that it becomes a means by which you can really communicate feeling and ideas that are otherwise uncommunicable. So my feeling about having uh, art and the buildings, particularly buildings where a lot of people assemble, not only for the people who work there, it's terribly important to have a feeling of pride and a little feeling of uh, being introduced to something that is beyond just business and beyond the, the counter where you put money in and out. And I think that's been very definitely proven in the buildings we've done for a home that there has been a, a public response. I've done innumerable banks in Texas and various parts of the country and had the same experience. So it isn't just uh, the fact that uh, it worked in a home. I think that the more one learns to speak the various art languages, the more you become a human being, the more, you, the more total of a person you become. And I've always been amazed how, the, how the, what we call the public responds. I think the public is hungry for good music, for good everything. 